Welcome. In front of me, I have a Redmi 9A, and today I will show you how you can bypass the Google verification on this phone. Uh, before I get started, I'm going to quickly talk about the state of the device right now. It's in a wrong language. I'll change that in a moment. Uh, but you can see I have already connected to Wi-Fi, and this is where you would typically need to verify the user, either screen lock or Google account. Now. I'm going to point it out. I know what the pattern here is, but I'm going to show you what it's not. So I'm going to be using this one later on and you can see it's not working. So it didn't verify it. This is the one that I'm going to use throughout the setup process later on as a way to bypass this. So first to get started, uh, you want to, let's see. Now I need to actually check out my uh, little guide. Um, so we're going to back out to Here. So if you're already connected to network, uh, then disconnect from it. So, all right, let me just first actually. Why is it not finding English? Oh, it's a region. Okay, that probably makes sense. Okay, so there we go. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna progress. I went too far, so let's for the Wi-Fi connection page. Ah, there we go. So here's my Wi-Fi. I'm gonna now scroll down and select forget network. Okay. Then I'm gonna select skip. Keep in mind the device is still locked. Go to next. Only screen lock. I'm gonna again select the pattern. Got it. And now I'm gonna use this pattern, which, as you see me at the very beginning of the video, did not work. That's one, and that's two, and it's set. Now back out again to the Wi Fi connection page. I think I just passed already. There we go. And I'm gonna reconnect to my network. <clears throat> there we go. And we're gonna progress again forward through the setup. And now, again, we have the verification, and we're gonna now use the same verification that we have just literally set up a moment ago. Very secure. Um, so basically what happens when you disconnect from Wi-Fi, this device allows you to go partially through the setup, which idiotically includes setting up a screen lock, and the device can only have one screen lock at a time, so it just overrides the old one. And because it allows us to progress even without the Wi-Fi, without needing to verify anything, uh, you can do that. Now, mind it, if you disconnect from Wi-Fi and try to finish up the setup, it will bring you back straight to the beginning of the setup without connecting to network. But still, you can set up a screen lock, then re-enable Wi-Fi, and then use that screen lock as a verification method, which you just seen me do. Now, there is one last thing that I recommend doing, which is once you are finished with the uh, setup of the device, uh, perform a factory reset of it done through settings. This will ensure that if there is still any kind of uh, leftovers from the previous uh, kind of uh, security measures, uh, it will be removed uh, by doing this kind of reset. So I'm gonna finish up the setup and show you where you can find that in a moment.
So you can see we are now on a home screen and like I mentioned, the last thing that you would want to do is navigate into the settings. In here, select about phone, scroll down and select factory reset, erase all data, confirm your pattern that you have chosen. And hopefully it won't actually go through it, hello. I think it's actually going through the factory reset in a second, right? Okay, I think it just literally froze. Yep. Uh, I think this is actually the account, uh, the Xiaomi account. Let's quickly check. As if I go to Google, there is nothing in there. For goodness sake, this is running a little bit slow. Let's see, accounts and sync. Okay, so that's a no. Oh yeah, there we go, me account. Uh, so because this, uh, this phone did have a me account before, uh, that's one of the people at work uh, account, which I don't really know how to sign out of it. Um, me account can be bypassed. I just want to point that out. If you have anything else, uh, like a Google account, this can be. Uh, with me accounts, it's problematic, but mm, this was already kind of verified and it, he selected to keep it. So it just kind of made a problem right now. But uh, Google accounts don't really have any problems. With me accounts, you wouldn't even be able to bypass anything or get access to the home screen. So um, me accounts, no go whatsoever, uh, Google, no problem. So uh, like I mentioned, to finish up the bypass, uh, you just need to perform a factory reset in here. I can't because it has a me account, but any other thing without me account, you can go through it without a problem. Unfortunately for me, that's not an option. So anyway, hopefully you found this video helpful. Um, and if you did, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.